Headed out to Tampa to the RV Super Show, and uh, Lisa's looking for her next new RV. <laughs> it's like the temperature today is going to be about 65 degrees, so we threw us a little light jacket on, or at least have one with us in case we need it. But should be comfortable for walking around all the vendors and stuff. It's it's held at the uh, state fairgrounds, uh, US 301 North in uh, Tampa. We're staying in Wildwood, Florida. It's actually the closest place that I could get a spot of one we would want uh, when I was making reservations when it looked like we were going to get to go. To Turn left at the traffic light. We're getting on I-75 here now off of Highway 44 in Wildwood. And we'll be headed south down to the show. Lisa's off a quiet this morning over there. Won't bore you with interstate travel. We'll pick it back up when we get to the show. You can see the traffic is backed up here to get in here to the show. We're in Tampa and trying to get in here to the fairgrounds, then just into the parking area. Still working on that concept now. Well, we're still working our way. At least turning on the road now. Now we're coming up on, we see why there's such a traffic jam. First thing they want is to separate you from some of your money. And this is just the first spot. Then you've got to get your ticket to get inside. up too fast.
Okay. Fine, how are you? That's a start. <laughs> yes, ma'am. You too. Thank you. Well, we finally got parked right over there. You see, there is a lot of people here. And we're just in one small section of the parking area. Now we've got to go figure out how to get in this place. We're coming into the first booth area and actually looking for a restroom. It's a concession stand. Yeah. How you doing? I was right behind you in my car. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you go left. Yeah. Core Resort. Sure would. That would look good down on the uh, patio up uh, right there, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. If you could secure that down where it wouldn't blow away. Yep. Corn dog. Get a breath of fresh air.
Did he say what name brand? Class B. Is that comfortable? Oh yeah. Yeah, it is actually. Surprise. Boy, they put a lot in one of these, don't they? I know, it even has a shower. Oh wow. Got all three pieces in there. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you can get a good shave in. <laughs> you got it all. Have a good day. doing her research. What coaches? Coach. Still hadn't seen any of those. Okay. go back down. I want to look in this preceptor. This is the precept prestige. $144,000 sale price. It's got a nice, nice pot pit on it. All stainless, dual sink. Looks out to a bed there. And 
this is the precept prestige turn it come on got a bad bed overhead This is the General RV Center Holiday Rambler section, it looks like. I'm gonna put my mask on and go up in this one a minute. King size bed that folds up like a nice big bathroom. My fat ass in the mirror, and that mirror, shower, washer and dryer. No carpeting, that's always a plus. Bath and a half. Control panel. This, oh, got an overhead bed too. And this is the Holiday Rambler Armada 44LE. Fireplace. Table and work area. Televator. Ooh, dishwasher. Second TV. These LXEs like we looked at. Discovery LXE. Discovery LXE. I like that color scheme there. This one? Yeah. Lighter. Well, lighter, but it would it'd be more difficult to keep clean with that white, <laughs> you know. The brownish and maroon is hard enough. I won't move it to my Yes, I'm going to walk up in here. There's an American coach, 409. Discovery LXE. Nice bath. Probably a washer and dryer in here. There is. Separate washer and dryer. Got a uh, vacuum system. Televator in the bedroom. Yeah. 
bathroom. It is. Yeah. Large bathroom. Very large. Very spacious. I've been there now. What else is the difference between the American and the Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. Overhead bed. Yeah. Okay. Here's the American Coach, American Dream, 42V. Sale price, $459,999. You tear up a $460,000 bill there real quick. Has the what? Has a, has a oh, okay, yes. Mm -hmm. This is the American Dream 45A. Gotta look at this. Yeah. Got to go look at this. This one's active, isn't it? Got a front entry. It was six to five the floor was Is that a washer and dryer? Bath and a half. Yeah, full, full electronics. Really like it until it breaks. This one doesn't have the tub. Yes, it is. No carpeting, level floor, no step up here. I do like that. No carpet is the way to go. Thank you. I don't know that I have uh, ever seen a Class A with a tub in it. Have we? Do what? Yeah. They could. This coach is sold. Was a five ninety nine, seven eighty four. I don't know, but we're gonna see. This one's on sale for six hundred and seventy thousand, six sixty. Sorry. Oh, sorry, pardon me, sir. Emergency exit door. Washer and dryer and 
spice rack all in one. Maybe you can have like one person you can choose you can choose the cock chip. All electronic. I do too. Coming into the Newmar section. North Trail RV Center. Motorhome Superstore. But first, a word from our sponsor. Lisa is on a mission to find a beer truck. Sniffed it out. No rating. Lisa, get one of these two, please. She is set. She'll just stay. She'll just stay here till I get through looking. Got the beer stand there. Pizza, calzones, spaghetti and meatballs, and confetti. In this new Mars I like to think I'm hot. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, baby, that's a hot boy. I think we have to go this way. Right here. And then, kind of in the middle of them. And then. I don't know what that was supposed to be, other than a grapevine, I guess. Come on, Felicia. Entertain me. There. We're in a Newmar section. Sold. Sold. Well, that's what they brought them here for us to sell them. <laughs> that one sold too. Sold. That one's got that uh, refrigerator. I'm not sure, still don't see the name brand on that, but that's the one that we're wanting. London Air. Sold. <laughs> Do what? All these here, new Mars have been sold. Here's a Dutch star that has not. Do what, honey? Do what? Let's look at it. This is the Supreme Air. Supreme. 
This is that super set you wanted to see. Going up in the Supreme Air. Start in the back. Mid bathroom. size bed This is the Super C by Numar. Wash and dry. True induction cooking. Plastic donuts. I wonder if those donuts come with it. Okay, the one in this Dutch star. This one's pretty. Now we have the locks, like all these other coaches' class C's and everything. I don't like it. I can't bring myself down to that. I'm like, I don't want to pay that. Right. So. Yeah, I do too. I like the bathroom. It's nice. Do you like the blue color? Do you like the blue color? Yeah. What, are you going to go lighter? Yeah. That's what I have. So I have a combination yeah. of the lighter. We have the beach front. Yeah. Yes. So the be I have the, uh, what's, the, what's the lighter color? The beach front? Beach front. Yeah. And then what's the darker color? Mm. Uh, I know, but you have that on the island. I have that on the island. Yeah. And then I have that on the wardrobe in the master. See, and that makes it, it just looks bigger when it's lighter. Yeah. Blue. And then I went different colors on the sofa and the, and the theater seat are two different colors. So you okay. go with the lighter wood, like Easier that's what we like. like. It just yeah. makes it feel bigger. It does, it does. Yeah, it, it, does. It, it, it doesn't look as dark. You can feel like more light so in it. How long have you had it? April. Maybe a year. They picked it up after us. We were there during COVID, March. Oh, we were all excited. We, we spent two nights in the factory. That closed life. We did five. Well, and. So why do you want to get rid of it? Um, I just. I feel like it's, this is just an easier lifestyle than that's what we're coming to. It's like just hooking on hooking, dragging it around. Like. Yeah. But all the other stuff that comes with it, yeah, we got a lot of room. Emergency exit door there, big shower, decent sized bathroom, stackable washer and dryer. This is the new Mar King Air. This is nice. Couple of vanities. I'm not over the axle way, but if I do it from my way, I'm, like, I'm always driving. We're all, that's what we found. We, we did. We're like we're always over the way. I mean, what are you driving? If I come with the forty five hundred, it wouldn't matter because they have the same Jeep as that door. The boat and the Jeep. Yeah. <laughs> and a trailer. Yeah. Oh, my There's craft the, room. Yes. Your office and my craft room. New Mark King here. Doors closed. Yeah. Something tells me it's sold. <laughs> yep, sold. Boy, they've had a good show.
Buster and Levon, congratulations. That's why we like it so well. Mm -hmm. Another Dutch star. Yes. That's a short, shorter one. That's not me. The nation is store. Essex. Is that a new one? I had not know that I've seen one of those. Here is something Lisa and I are wanting to add to ours. It's the Dometic CFX cooler and freezer. Here. Yes. So one side could be a freezer and one side could be a fridge. Can be a refrigerator, yes. And it connects Bluetooth if it if you lose power or it gets below a certain temperature, you get notified upstairs. Snap a picture of that. That's a good hold my beer. Famous water. Um, From the children. <laughs> that's a good uh, size too. It'll fit right where it Yeah, it's that's that's what that compartment was made for. That's an added option. It and the and the rails. I'm going to walk up in here. This is the Essex suggested retail, 873-075. They'll throw in some of those plastic donuts we've been seeing in some of the other ones. Oh, really? <laughs> so you're videoing it? Yes. Trying to log it. This is nice back here. I don't like it as, as dark. It's dark it is dark. It's probably one of the darkest ones I've seen. It's oh, pretty, it's, but, it's but it's just too dark for me. It's an Essex. Maybe your wife might like it. Yeah. You look at uh, all around in here. Boy, they sold a lot. This dealership here in here. They got several that's got sold on them. Good, I know they that's, sold the King Air. The, that's what was, they... It was sold before noon on Wednesday. Wow. I think it was sold before it got here. They just didn't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> the emergency exit. Sorry, pardon me. Thank 
matter. Shaky did it. Let's go upstairs loft on both sides. Really? Is it pretty large? Well, the one on the right's a little larger than this one. This one on the left would be like a coffin. Oh. Seems the children? I could warm up in there. Center bathroom. Do what? Right on one side, it's on the other. Those are the only ones that come visit. Oh, yeah, this is made to be up on cement blocks. I don't like it as well as I like the separation. Mm -mm. What is this here? Pantry? Yeah, pantry. Yeah. Springdale. You see this right here? They make a small version of that for indoors. And you can get it brown like the floor. Get my wiring to our couches. Yes, you can. Look at me. And every time I say you're correct. It is not user pretty. <laughs> Ten thousand. Is that a loft up there? Oh, it raises up. Well, I didn't notice that. Got a bad overhead on that one, like the old Volkswagen buses. Lazy days.
pardon me. 116,702 Class B. This is the 2021 Heartland Cyclone 4007, 112,846, fifth wheel. This is the toy hauler. It has a tub. It has a tub. It does. Walk-in closet and a three-inch mattress. That's conducive for living, isn't it? There's a lot of space up in there. It's pretty, yeah, yeah. I like the layout. And you have the toy compartment. It got the side door too or just the rear? Well, it's got a little side door. This is a Mobile Suites fifth wheel. This is a long one. 44 feet, 151,565. I'm going to go up in here and look at this one. I'm doing well. How are you? I'm good. Well, this is a long one. Yes, it's 44 foot. Big old bathroom closet. Bath and a half.
Renovago section. They do. I, I was just thinking, I didn't see any dual axles here. With this dealership in Winnebago, I'll say that. Yeah, but it's it's just 40 foot. There's the Tiffin section. Starting the Tiffin section. Oh, there's the Integra. There's the Integra. Where do you want to go first? We can go here. Tiffin? Mm-hmm. I didn't know Tiffin made a fifth wheel. Okay. Never knew they made a fifth wheel. Van Lee, a division of Tiffin. They're all the same. That's the Tiffin Austin? Yep. Do what, honey? It's laid out a little different. It does yeah. Steps right there. I'm going in this one. Have fun with your life. Mm -hmm. That's an odd color. red leg row bus 35 foot XSP. Got a couple of those. Forty-five OPP. Yeah, I haven't seen that one. I'll get this on video. Did you open it? Yeah. See that slide was made for the for that, for that other one. Yeah. 
This is a 45 OPP too we're looking at. Pardon me, sir. Tracks, fireplace in the bedroom. The bathroom, large shower, walk-in closet. Fuse block. Oh, I've got the emergency exit back there too. Don't have a price tag listed on this one. I'm sure they're proud of it. Big old cockpit, dual screens. Looks like it may be power, Brad. I bet it is. It might be. Yep, right here. Oh. Oh, yeah. It's not going either direction. It would be. This one over here is. These have quite a different price range. The what? Yes, I saw that in that other one back there. Yeah, this is the top top of the Zephyr. Let's walk in it. This is the Tiffin Zephyr. This is Tiffin's top of the line class A now this one has a large trimmer version two sides we'll have to look at the reviews yeah. and stuff yeah. see which one's best In this one, this is the top of the line. Tip top. That must go up electric. Your 
Yeah. Yeah, this is the 45 PZ, right? Okay. Yeah, they don't even have the price. Yeah. Well, this is probably an option. Come on, boom. Yeah. Yeah, the uh, six hundred wood, it's like a beige, yeah. the beige. Showing the emergency exit. At least I could sleep without the air on in this one on those cold nights, as long as you let me open this door. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that's nice. I do too. That's nice. Walk in the closet. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, you said. Cornerstone from the K3 chassis, 605 horsepower. Diesel Cummings. Yeah, that has the Dometic. Want to go in? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I sure do. Five hundred ninety-five thousand. Yeah, they have different layout versions for the same coach. Even like for ours, there's a different number has a different layout version. Not water and ice in the refrigerator, is there? There is not. Have to change that. Can't Yeah, this has that rear closet, walk-in type closet, like yeah. The washer and dryer there. Yep. Got one there, but sitting there, you can't see the big one sitting over here. That's the carpet like ours. It's got the same dash, except they just went with the computer screen on the new one. If you look at the layout. I wonder what year they did that. Oh, in uh, either 19 or 20. No, no, it's okay. It doesn't have a bump, so <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> okay, good. Let's check in. It's an anthem. 
Okay. This is the Integra Anthem. Yeah. Just the re restroom and all is on the opposite side. This is similar to ours. As far as the layout. Down, down okay, man. We have the 44B and it doesn't have the bounce, which we did not want those, but we really like the drop down bed. That is awesome. Oh wow. That's... I know, let's go look at that. Pardon me. It's a little different layout. It's got two little pantries. Two pantries, yeah. And uh Oh, I'm nice. And our seating, booth seating. So they've got these pulled out. It's slippery. Everything else is virtually the same. Bathroom bit here too? Mm hmm. Small bathroom. Where's the shower? In the middle? I guess. Yeah, I guess that's your wash and dryer, yeah. I guess the shower's in the middle. Half bath in the back. I guess because of the bunks. I don't know. Spartan Chaser.
goes from that to that. <clears throat> it's called the jumping jack. $6,000. I use them for my dogs. Uh, they are eight feet long, so we do have a lot of people. Actually, a lot of our out west, a lot of our guides and outfitters are doing They put their clients up in the bed, and the guide or outfitter will sleep down there. Yeah, you Nexus RV, 221,000, Super C. Look, it's on an international frame. <laughs> Bonk overhead. On a Freightliner chassis, not international. Bunk model. This is something I have not seen. This is a Canyon Star by Newmar front engine diesel. I didn't know they made a front engine diesel anymore other than the super seas and, yeah. the, and the seas. Yep. It's crazy. This is their toy hauler version. This is a front front engine, front diesel engine, toy hauler by Neymar to Canyon Star. It's kind of small, but if that's what you're needing, if it serves the purpose, That's why I wouldn't buy one if we had the money, because they think they're too it's too damn good for you to look at without an appointment, you know. Coach actually started some 50 years ago uh, with my mom and dad building the first coach for me. It's very complex. Uh, 
These are the feather lights here. Here's one that's open. It's a pre You gotta take your shoes off. I'm not taking my damn shoes off to go look at one. If it can't handle me walking on it in my shoes, I damn sure don't want to buy it. If I had the money to buy it. This is the mail files. What is the shortest model? 45 shares. That's what right. oh. that lady's asking what the shortest model is. Yeah, I do too. No, he sold it. Last time I was in Gunnersville, I asked him if he still had it. He told me he had sold it. There's the four travels like we saw down in Texas. I'm sorry. I apologize. I, th I thought we were through. This is the four travel realm. No, Patrick. A lot of wood. Got a lot of wood color, doesn't it? Yeah. But it's nice. Though. It is nice. Bunk model. Probably. I see the TV. You know, that's the TV right there. That's the TV? This is the TV. Oh, that comes down. Wow. For your entertainment. Yeah. We're in a rabbit. Emergency door. Shower. Is there a shower back there too? Mm -hmm. Is there a shower there too? Oh, okay. With a tub? A lot of wood in it, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's dark. Yeah. Everything's got to be so dark all the time. Yeah. And, and you're already living in a dark tunnel. <laughs> I think a lot of them are starting to They are. 
It is. in the vendor area again, a different vendor area. Adventure Caravans. We have found something that we can't live without. We're still here in the vendor area. We just purchased a pillow for me firm pillow I've been looking for, cool pillow, and we got some plastic bowls. Getting late in the day, so this is kind of getting full in here, people working their way toward the exit.
three owners. This is the one I've been looking at online, this Fantasy RV Tours. Yeah. That's the one I've been looking at online. Just about their tours, what they offer, that's the one I've been looking at. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, if we were taking... Stop right here just a second. <laughs> 